Another bombshell tonight. That report out of the L.A. County Sheriff's Department. Four more deputies fired. Hey, they have now gotten their deputy or their badges back, bringing that total to six deputies reinstated under new L.A. County Sheriff Alex Villanueva. Kick on is Christy Fajardo live tonight with more on this story. Christy. Yeah, Jeff, the new sheriff has argued that in the past, his department has been too quick to fire deputies and maintains he has the authority to rehire them. But that's not sitting well with the county board of supervisors here who worries he is rolling back important reforms. Another headline could lead to another showdown with the county board of supervisors who believe Sheriff Alex Villanueva is overstepping his authority. It feels like things are out of control. Um, and it doesn't bode well for the Los Angeles County Sheriff's Department. The LA Times report didn't give specifics on why the four newly disclosed deputies were terminated, but Villanueva has defended rehiring two others who were fired. One was dismissed for what you see on this video, which was deemed by the DA's office to be unnecessary force. The other, Karen Mondoyan, served on the sheriff's campaign after he was fired for allegedly assaulting a woman and lying about it. He tells our Randy Page. Did you ever try to choke her? No, sir. Did you ever hit her? No, sir. The County Board of Supervisors is taking the sheriff to court over Mondoyan's reinstatement. And Supervisor Mark Ridley Thomas believes even more fire deputies than we know may now be back on the payroll. So we have to ask Sheriff Vienna Weaver, what's next? How low are you going to go? In a statement, the sheriff didn't address the newest cases directly, but defended his authority to rehire those who have been stripped of their badge, saying in part, we have 68 cases that have not been heard at the commission. As such, I have directed all of our division chiefs to look through each of these cases, assess all of the related statements and evidence to see if those cases can be sustained through the civil service. So what's next? Supervisor Mark Ridley Thomas says there could be more legal challenges. Live in downtown LA, Christy Fajardo, KCAL 9 News.